What is up guys, Son of Beast here. We are starting with another NBA Finals of the Bucks against the Lakers, and this is Game 4. As of right now, the Bucks takes the lead with the series with an unbeatable crush on the Los Angeles Lakers, as they scored it up with an amazing, uh, with amazing night by each players, including Brooke Lopez, Eric Bledsoe, Giannis Antetokounmpo, and of course, Robin Lopez, making a bunch of, uh, of just the contesting the shots right in and out. But let's find out what happened here. With I have the statement with uh, with a jersey for the Bucks, but for the icon, but I have the icon for the Lakers. In the neighborhood, we got. By the neighborhood, we got some few events coming up today. As coming up from NBA 2K Compete. As this one, Saturday, will be uh, will be tomorrow on uh, at 9 p.m. And then Sunday on June 7th is the Gold Rush at 12 p.m. in the regional. But our last scores are just coming out through right in. And then it will be Tuesday, June 9th, all day, 2K Rep Cagas in the Global. Then, firstly, on June 11th, there will be Treasure Hunters from the Global, and you'll never get to see which one you have. And then, finally, your claiming choices as one of each sets are coming in to see what you have. The Triple Threat Online and Mystery Packings of Card Ones through anything. Morning YK will be expiring on June 9th, and the Throwback Moments will expire on Wednesday, June 10th. And we'd like to say thank you to these new legends that, we, that comes in with the top place and nobody would ever see that before. Anyways, let's get right into game four and see who can take the battle of battle. This is it, the only game four is at Fiserv.fora. And then the next schedule for the Lakers, they'll be back home playing against the Bucks in LA in game five. If they win, then they're going back to Milwaukee in game six. But in that game, let's have a look at a Rongjian Ronda with the score. 8.2 was the only assist in this game, and 8.0 was 9th 12 by 2019 to this year. It was never happening before, but we just couldn't uh, find what was happening before. And that's a lot of the games that we are going for. Everything's going on here fine, but it's not enough to keep us on. Now we're ready to roll. Here's David Aldridge from the sideline. DA, good evening. Almost all of the Greek Freak's points come in the paint. Giannis said, I can already do a lot of damage, basically without a jump shot. Just driving, making plays, and free throws. When that jump shot comes, it's going to be a problem for a lot of players in this league. Kevin? <laughs> He's having a lot of problems right now with the shooting here, with the rivaling matchup, but that's okay. He's doing really well in keeping it back on the line. We'll see if he can burn another Jordan player of the game. We're not sure what will happen here, but Anthony Davis is saying, I'm all hyped up, I'm ready to go. Don't be, uh, don't be surprised, fool, like uh, Giannis. These are the key matchups that nobody has ever seen it before right from here. Frank Vogel and Mike Budenholzer. Role or just game back into the game. Get you to play. So right now, let's find out what is happening here in the statement of the court. Here we go, fans. Game four, here we go. Here's Giannis starting with a winning tip-off, and we're ready to go. Middleton over James. Nice shot for Middleton with the start, and James takes his first personal foul on the shocking call. A lot of man spotting going over by the paint and the block. Chris Middleton's Middleton made a couple shots here, but his first it looks like Austin Cooper was starting to pass out with uh, uh, Middleton. Chris was dealing with but, uh, but a lot of dealings are just way off. Season, you won't never know. Settled back down. Well, we got into a position turn. That's just crazy. He knows where he I belongs. know about it. He knows how important <clears> he is to the Milwaukee Bucks and their continued success. They're definitely continuing and striving towards a championship for the city. One shot left for Middleton. Oh, 
He makes one in. He banks it up here, which is three, three poisons. The first bucket of the night. He says was the turn. Here's Brad Perry here on the on the, on the commentators. No signs for Bill Simmons to be on the uh, special guests. Maybe adjust some of his work. Forty. Bradley with the three. Rebound by Davis. He didn't sink this two, but it went off way deeper than I thought. Here's Brooke Lopez with just under 630 remaining. Following the miss. Rolling it over to Austin Kupo. Shoots over Davis. Number two, corner. Not set up for another story, but the line. It's a three point Green up. And it's alley oop by McGee. He pulls off the Houdini to take that catch and slam it through. Stupendous. Stupendous game here as McGee takes his first bucket. Assist by Green. Bledsoe. Rolls it over to Matthews. Shoots over Green. And it's Green missing. For Los Angeles. They Los Angeles, they made a loss at that moment after game three. It was an unacceptable call at that moment. Calling on the other players of the, uh, of the Lakers. That was just like, not that fair to go from here. It was very tough to go from a losing moment to a winning moment. It's not quite enough to get there in time. But that's a changing story. Matthews, Matthews goes over to the green, and slips the two, and he takes the first bucket of the night. 5.15 left to go. Here's uh, James. 29 points for him last game. After the last game by eight points, it was seemingly like he was going to take 10 points in the game. It's happened with the first day after a regular season loss against the Rockets. And sometimes in the playoffs here, that comes out with a strong emotion after two shots. Giannis has the ball. Penetrated. Pass to Brook Lopez. Oh, Brook finds Middleton. Middleton, Middleton to Bledsoe. Six on the shot clock. Bledsoe takes the two. And he will take the, for look at the first assist by Brook Lopez. Side of him, but he can have some nights. You always have to account for him. Pass to McGee. McGee steps in the paint, and it's not Shakubo, so they get two rebounds and down here. Middleton taking a two, shoots it from a three-point outside, this by Shakubo. Well, a lot of contested shots are just way off the target here from the Lakers. Not for the Bucks. they always keep it back in right on time. They've been struggling here on they struggled here on offense here after sure. game two with the loss McGee against the Bucks. Bucks. But that's really fine because that's they did not get it. And, and, and here's the dunk by McGee, yeah, assisted nice by James. Strong finish on the inside. The great number strong guys, he's got finishing the right from the board. That might be a hard time. It's through. very efficient and well-tuned offense for the Bucks. They drive, they kick, they get open. Here's, uh, here's Matthews. Second in the league last year, as that was my Bounce pass back to Bledsoe. Biggest change in threes. Shot clock at six. Shot clock down to six. Here's Shoots over Bradley. That one. That one off oh, target. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just looks crazy with whiffs on that. And it looks Shot like uh, Danny Green was setting up a number two. Bradley just by Bradley. That he and that's him to see what the two-pointer difference position. is. They're going to keep it far. With the bucks in there. Brooke Lopez coming in on the paint. With Starts with Giannis, and that Passed might have got them into trouble last year. They could maybe use another creator in a way where a guy Bledsoe can... Bledsoe rolls it over to Oxtacubo. Six to go. Growth He's got to get it. Middleton as he tries to improve his game. Yeah, he's a last, last touch by Eric Bledsoe, and I'll change it into a Lakers ball. More dynamism. On the offensive end. Your new changes daily. Great McGee, Green and Bradley are checked out. Rondo and Purple Fulton Howard are checked in. The Lakers also made the same changes. And then Matthews and Bledsoe are checked out. As George Hill and DiVincenzo are checked in. For Danny Green. Howard outside. For Avery Bradley. Covered by Brooke now, Lopez, 250 left. Rondo, amazing layup, a big tie to game. Good decision this is right there from Howard. Howard. Excellent 242 awareness left. on that particular play. Ashikupo going in. It's stolen, it's stolen by Davis. 
And pushing it up. Here comes James. James I mean, James will take the Beautiful take the tie, untieable break execution from uh, at its 12 best. to 10. Yeah, once you burst first to lead up to, uh, you up to two right towards the rim will be LeBron Smith James. Middleton on the wing. <clears throat> James trying to James against Middleton. Pass out to Kubo. And oh, over ahead by D. White Howard. And there's that dunk that almost goes going to get whacked on. Didn't see that one coming. Two minutes left here in the first period. Tough loss coming against the Rockets in the last game they played. This was happening here at the last game after the Bucks didn't win against the. Uh, it's the Rockets. Davis going over at Scrupo. It's another shot. It's been missed. 5-8 from, from the field goal for the Bucks. And 40 left. Trying to recover it. And they still keep the Bucks ball alive. Last touch by Anthony Davis. And Frank Vogel still kept it silent again all the last couple games. Giannis made a lead by 15.1. And he was tied up with Hassan Whiteside from that game. That he was never been playing with the uh, Miami Heat back in the last season of the game. Still looking for his first five to go. Drive and the second foul going on James. And he'll go to the line for two. Middleton will go to the line to shoot two. His way back and come a long way. The former second foul. A lot of long way. He's going out right for the line. He made the only free throw attempt he had earlier in the game. Dude, gotta admire what he's been able to do. Yeah, that was a little bit unnecessary to put up for James. That's uh, that was a strange moment. Wasn't gonna happen again. Like the whole time. First shot for Middleton's good. As Oxygrupo is subbing out as the Sofa is checked in. And it will be uh, Davis and James subbing out. Morris and Kuzma are checked in. Then, on the other hand, we have his Oxygrupo Brook Lopez. Robin Lopez is checked in. Last shot for Middleton. He takes two in a row. Eight points for tonight. His routine, his and 25 left to go. 14-12 is your score. Hill against Rondo. Screen on Kuzma. You pull around Kuzma with the three. And there's your first basket for, for a first three-pointer for Kuzma. Assist by Rondo with the first. All night. Well, you can tell they really, really right increase this lead. Lopez. Keep letting them left to go. take it from him. Pass to DiVincenzo. Middleton again. Missing the three from outside. D.Y. Howard takes his first assist. First rebound. Another scoring position will be on Kyle Kuzma. By the 13 to 4 last run. The last 3 12 per minute. Hill bouncing it off to Ilya Silva. Morris against Ilya Silva. Back to Middleton. He backs up to Middleton. Kuzma. Kuzma going up with another drive. And a shot's good. Middleton takes his first personal foul. Stop the clock at 28.1 seconds left. He was not seeing everything going really well. But those other players, they need to stick up on the man coverage. Middleton is checked out. And it will be Connison checking in. And the Bucks with some changes. Kyle Corver checked Kyle in for Corver. And it's back Connaughton so in for Dante DiVincenzo. For uh, and Middleton and Connaughton checked, checked in for DiVincenzo. Caruso checked, in, Caruso with checked in with Cardwell Pope. That's One shot good. left for Kuzma. He made one. But that keeps him a lead by six. Bucks 26 six. seconds left here. Your skill passed up to uh, Connaughton. Shot and game clock separated by four. Outside Rolls up as Corfer. Pass to Connaughton. Connaughton. Six on a shot clock. 
Connaughton with the first drive and he makes the first two points. Five seconds left. Rondo without no luck with the bus beater. He made it. Managed to make it through. But that will be the end of the first quarter to put it up from here. And so it's 22 to 16 is your score. It looks like the Lakers are just pulling out to make the comeback rally, but that went too early for them to get off for the first quarter. We'll be right back after this. Second period starts right now. Here's Rondo meeting the buzz beater before the shot clock, before the game clock has ended. Morris up. Oh no, went too late, went too early with an air ball. Unbelievable, what just happened? I don't think that Ronda was in there right, but that was a little bit too much, too early to come from here. Robin Lopez sensing up with the first two. He's got his first basket of the night. Rolling around over to D.Y. Howard. And he went out there quick. Not the wrong thing that was going to happen. 6.30 left to be played on the second quarter. Caruso against Conate. Passes to Rondo. Screen on Kuzma. Brings up to Kuzma. And Kuzma is sending it up at number two. This is by Rondo. A lot of facing disappointments here in game three, but that might be the only changing that mean by name that they may need to keep it back in with the game and not lose it with another streaking in at that point. Kyle Corfer, two pointers good. He's got his first basket of the night. Didn't seem like he was nobody was like open, but he did take his time to shoot wide enough already. They could have played better first. First foul is going on Kyle Corfer. His first. Alex Caruso says, "Get off of me." Do you think this is uh, appropriate to uh, to talk like that? And then Kyle Corfer was saying, "Saying, what are you saying?" Shooting their second you know, I was just not doing it on to you, why hard on you. I was making the desk. Well, he would have talked to the referee already, but, they, but the sign means that Kyle Corporate already took his first personal foul. So Caruso, Caruso will manage to make to take two shots. And he first hits one, Williams, he's he hits the first the one. But so comes in for now here's Green, he subs in for Howard, as well. Green's as Green swoops over to, uh, to small four. Kuzma and Morris are switching. Williams and Bledsoe are checked in for George Gill and Eli Sofa. Caruso hits the second one. Bledsoe, so pass to Williams. Bringing it up for the Milwaukee Bucks. They trail by six. But they trail by six. Corver. Bounce pass to Robin Lopez. Pocket six. Pocket six. Bledsoe. Rolls to Robin. And Robin Lopez with the number two. Assist by Bledsoe. Bledsoe's feeding his guys. His team is much better for it. They love watching him whip the ball around the perimeter. 5-13 left to be played here in the first half. 5-10 left. 26 to 22 to score. Oh, screen might be pulling up on Morris. Rondo with another drive. Made the difference. The aggression here on March 6 here at that game. It got them points at the line and made foul points of the up concern. Light up here. We two fouls going on for Russo is first. And we're changing here as Rondo's checked out and Bradley is checked in. He finds Bledsoe, pass to Conate, rolls over to Corfer, back to Conate, shoots over Caruso. From deep, no good. And he was not getting close there, just like Stephen Curry did. However, Kuzma missed that shot. But the shot's still here for Robin Lopez to keep it going. Passes to Conaty. Rolls to Corver. He goes from Williams. Williams is up. First shot for Marvin Williams is good. 
And they are cutting in by two. Four. Outside. Four or five left. Green against Horford. Kicks it over. Stays on Green. Morris against Robin Lopez. Pass to Caruso. He rolls over to Kuzma. Shoots over Williams. And he puts another two pointer over Warren Williams. That's 12 points with a hot start. A lot of easy shots are going from the Lakers to put it up in. Corfer taking a three. And he takes another one. Just a fantastic ball movement here, assisted by Marvin Williams. Or Eric Bledsoe, I mean. But that might be a hot streak on uh, Kyle Corford to take up with a three-pointer range from outside. I don't know why he would do this way. I don't know why he would do it, but that's all he has to go. Nice deep by Robin Lopez after Morris misses the shot. Finds Kyle Corford. Down to five. Bounce pass. Let's over two. They get it he gets it back. Robin Lopez with the save. That's third bucket. Six points for Robin Lopez. And they keep it coming back in to fly it all over. Timeout Lakers. 2.43 left. The, the Bucks trail by two. A lot of coaches, a lot of trainings needed to be coming out strong. They are pumping it up right from the way of the starting before the first half comes to a close. Big group substitutions here as a new change comes up here for the Lakers. Matthews, he's checked in for Kyle. Matthews checked in for Kyle Corbett. Dante Divincent checked in for Matt Connaughton. And the Lakers checking in with another look. Anthony Davis comes in for Kyle. Davis is checking in for Kyle Kuzma. And Vanity Green checking in for Alex Caruso. Carl Pope checked in for Alex Caruso. And Brooke Lopez checked in for Robin Lopez. Brooke Lopez sends a delivering reverse layup. Great pass moment by DiVincenzo. A first assist that was going to be able to be picked out and knocking it in by Brooke Lopez to keep it from a uh, uh, over target. For the floor in the second quarter, three of six. Bradley against Bledsoe. Bradley, Block to pass, but recovered. Pass to James. Two. Mets in the first half. Four to shoot. Davis, no time. And here's a shot. And there's a shot from the uh, from over, uh, over Giannis. Contest. AD's jump shot. I mean, look how tall he is and where he shoots it from. Nobody's bothering him. Bledsoe bounce pass to Brooke Lopez. Overhead pass to Bledsoe. Pass out to Kupo. Pass to Brook Lopez. A shot over McGee is good. Assist by Antetokounmpo. Antetokounmpo's got three Four points for uh, for Brook Lopez. Antetokounmpo. Antetokounmpo's got three assists of the games tonight in game four. To play in the first half. It might be really much to keep from here. Davis, another dunk, and there they're coming again. They're making the lead right up with the opening heart. Just pulls it away. Here is Antetokounmpo. Antetokounmpo pass to DiVincenzo. Bounce pass to Bledsoe. Roll it in. The shot. The shot no for no good for from Bledsoe. Davis. They're all taking their time, not keeping an eye on the rim. Matthews against Bradley. Matthews against Bradley. Pass to LeBron. Pass to LeBron. Up the shot. And Antetokounmpo will take another rebound. Fourth rebound for tonight here again. Six seconds separating the shot and game clock. 22 seconds left here in, his, in the game clock before the first half comes to an end. And it's denied by Davis. Defense by Anthony Davis to spike. Wow, wasting time moment, but that's not how it's changed. Davis with the dunk. Oh my goodness! Even more important to an offense than that could be the assist by uh by Carmel Pope Bradley. I think. I think it might be Bradley. Matthews for a buzz beater. It bangs it up and through, and they end the first half. 
36 to 35, a close game series. A lot of downtown here. As for Matthews, are pulling up the Busby or try to go for the tie, but they didn't. So that'll be it for the first half. Now let's head here to DA. It's time now to go courtside as we send. DA, it's all yours. What do you have here? Thanks, Kevin, here with Coach Mike Budenholzer. Coach, probably not the defensive effort you were hoping for thus far. Yeah, no, our defense isn't where it needs to be. I think they're getting open looks. We're over shifting, and then we're not committing to shooters. Uh, just not a very good defensive effort so far. Mike, thanks very much for your time. Kevin, back to you. Thank you, DA. The third quarter will be starting on our way right now when we come back. We're all starting out here in the third quarter with a tremendous closing game without the call. But for the last possession, this was on Wesley Matthews that was been pointed up here. But this time, it was Kyle Kuzma. That was like sending out with a bunch of drives that was been pulling out recently, 12 points at the game. But he was noticing what his game would feel like. If his game was, is not the only momentum that was coming out by Alonzo Ball, then he may know that he does it every game. And a lot of discussions are going up here, but we'll have to discuss uh, with a lot of players at that moment what they do. And here's uh, here's Giannis Antetokounmpo following up on a contest shot by uh, by LeBron James, but it's covered by Brooke Lopez. We don't have to wonder anymore. Yeah, I don't think we need to wonder about. We don't need that one anymore. I don't think we all have it. Kevin was. And it's nine. Matthews recovered. Matthews way deep, but it went too far. Realizes the other forty. He's something else. Need something else to go through. Bradley outside. Bradley past the broad. Suits over Bledsoe. In the corner, Bradley. In the corner is Bradley. Five seconds to go to shoot. Shoots over Riddleton. And they don't have a shot either. A lot of taking ability to go in and out with all the gaming that was never going to happen again. This needs to be a good targeting practice. Pass to Brooke Lopez. There's the foul called on Nathan Bradley. His first two free throws for Brooke Lopez going on the line. More assertive in looking for his shot, which in turn a lot of shots are just coming out way too much targeting to everybody. But nobody has got into a into a fight yet. Here's first shot for uh, for Lopez. He first makes one in. Well, he coined the name himself last season. Brent, he changed here, Bradley, in the year checked out. Howard Lopez and Rondo are checked in. I am, but I think Brooke Lopez and Brett says checked out. Some and George Hill will be coming so back him in. And his brother could get free rides for the rest of their lives. Hill, he's checked in for the Bucks. And Last Bucks. shot for Brooke Lopez is good, and he extends one point lead so up over the Lakers. It's a 36, Kevin, but when you look 37 to 36 your score. You see that call. It's almost now we're trying to go back with another look at an open drive. Or too wide, and Kevin Garnett was the, the biggest problematic moving speed. James against Middleton. Being 6'11 and. Trying to go around it. Sousa for Giannis. But it's a rebound by Brooke Lopez with the second rebound of the game. 520 left to be played in the uh, third quarter. Matthews didn't care about it. Well, that's not a way. That's not a smart move to uh, that Wesley Matthews was going to take it. But that's not really cool. Good D by Lopez. Good D by Brooke Lopez. And a good rebound. Here's D.Y. Howard, and he stopped it from here. Tried to come up with a finishing layup and gets a dog, but that's all they need to go with. Only one turnover for the Lakers, but only and four turnovers for the Bucks. Went really tough to keep it going from the live. Giannis finds Middleton, Middleton the best to and there he rolls it along to Ro Here's Lopez. Ro Lopez. The Kumbo, trying to free him, Try to free him up here for Antetokounmpo, but no Lopez shot left for, no shot yet for Brook Lopez. Green made the three, 
And now a four point lead. And now their four point lead was pulling out to a stop. Time out called by the Bucks with just 422 remaining. Time out of the game. And coach like how this is happening. I don't know what will happen. Every possession. Got a few. The Bucks need to get back into those adjustments. Pull the right strings. That's what they All like right, to so do. All right, so I'm making them some new changes here. Not a good way to keep with an offense going in. Let's do uh. <clears throat> Shot off 2018 that moment. Let's see how it works. So the make room substitution here for, in for the Lakers. Ilya Sova comes in for Giannis Antetokounmpo. Kyle Korver, he's checked in for Chris Middleton. And it's Pat Connington in for Wesley Matthews. And then for Los Angeles, Morris is checked in for Davis. Kyle Kuzma comes Jesus. in for James. And it's Alex Caruso in for Green. And it's Connington missing. Connington with a missed shot of Malaya, but that could be hard. It's a really ragged start. A nice seam draw moving here for the Rondo with the score. The transition Over in so far, Pat Connington wasn't able to take a shot right at that moment. Find a way to 350 left to go. Now the pass to Ilya Sofa. Pass to Ilya Sofa. Ilya Sofa pass to Williams. Howard against Williams. Williams over Howard. And he gets it to go. Got his second, bucket. second bucket of the night will be for will be on Morgan Williams. Nice spin moving here, as I just remember. Third quarter action. Third quarter was coming into a screaming halt. Outside. Morris finds Rondo. Sweet out Kuzma. Let's a floater go. Another floater for for Rondo, but it missed again. Guys are looking for a spark here. Not a spark here yeah, at that moment. That over. might be a over a shot at that time. Eliasova against Morris. Williams. Moves around over to Connaughton. Releases he releases up. Nice, nice shot here over Caruso. Caruso. And now it'll be four points for Connaughton. For Los Angeles, they've gone three of eight so far in the third quarter. Connaughton trying to go over with rhythm. another look. Rondo with the screen on Kuzma, and it's off the glass. Rondo's got 10 and points in the game. The ball inside and it's working. And they're working up with the play and I have an idea. Four two from deep to start things here in the second half. Four for a pass to Williams. 241 left. Hill. Pulls over Hill. Hill, no good. Hill, no good. It's Kuzma. It's Kuzma. Two free throws, Two free throws coming, coming up for Kuzma, Kuzma after the fouls going on. Marvin Williams stopped the clock at 221 left on the, on the game clock. Kyle Kuzma really fits the It's big for that. Is he a four? I don't know, but he gets. I'm telling you, there is like nothing else. The first one falls. First four balls it in. And very light foot. And his car will go. Moves well. Subbing in for uh, Marquis you know, Morris. And, and turn Dante DiVincenzo. Well, he has the ability to he light up in and with, score uh, something every team. With Pat Connaughton. And the Bucks making a change I mean, uh, here. Uh, DiVincenzo's checked in. All and Pat Connaughton switches over to the shooting guard. Free throws good. Two free throws good here for Kyle Kuzma. Two twenty left. Kicks the hill. Kicks off the hill. Moves up. The shot of the the here is good for baseline. He's not a long, but the applicability was just way off the mark. And here is Los Angeles now. Now Rondo. He's got 10. Here's Howard. And Howard with the lower dunk. Taking it to Take it easy, man. Power. I don't know Down why it was going on with him, but he's like, he's like destroying it now. Here's Hill. But Hill finishes the layup. Hill's got four of this quarter. Four he points for this quarter. George Hill helping him. He looks like he's doing all right. Advantage yeah. and slices to the rim and scores. He's doing really well. Trying to get that one. 138 left from, from the third. Now here's Rondo. 
He dishes it to Rondo. Rondo, number three, and he gets it in. Rondo's got the lead up to seven now. Got the lead up to seven right now. And here's Marvin Williams at the two. And he made it up. Made the three. Let me check that one more time right now. that play there. I don't see that he just made the uh, three-pointer, but I'm not sure if it is. Left to play here on the but 11 board. left to go. 52, oh, 48 to score. Barbo Pope against Ilya Sopa. Oh, 105 to go. Suits over Kainate. They grab it back. Back to Rondo. The Rondo. It's too wide. Bucks ball. possession. What a nice game in possession it is, but uh, I don't think it's it very hard to lose. From the real NBA, here Here's a look at the elite leaders of the Seals game. You need to play Lakers take heads up. The fourth spot held by the Lakers. 8.6 by, by the Seals. That was never happening. I mean, they'll never happen in four. And no surprise to see them. The rebound it, and let our Seals. They can trade two more. seconds left to go. Be the right move, I believe, right now. Shot by Carwell Pope, Pope, no good. good. That's kept this game close. 35 to seconds left to play here in the first quarter. Both teams are almost tied. Bounce past the kind of tape. William, 20 seconds left in the third quarter. It's, it's away. Shots good for Connaughton. Fouls on Howard. A tremendous athlete. What a tremendous game this is for Pat Connaughton to save it from the rebound. A different look from Milwaukee. It's a different look as all five players is checked out. All five players are checked in. Bradley Cauley Stein switched over into shooting guard. Then it's uh, Davis, James, and McGee. And here's a new change this year for the Bucks. And Bradley subbed in for Rajon Rondo. James settling up on the court. He's like, hustle, he's like hustled up and ready to go. Ten seconds left. Five seconds. James. But the clock is stopped as DiVincenzo wants to turn the thing over and, and try to stop it in time. Pat Connaughton is checked out and Chris Middleton is checked in. 3.6 seconds left. Last possession of the third quarter before the fourth quarter hits the target. And that'll be the it stays up with the Lakers ball, but Robin Lopez didn't seemingly care about it. Brooke Lopez on the court. Yeah, appreciate the work. One more look here. Defensive that moment. Here's the shot for Davis. And the last shot, no good. 52 to 51 is your score with the end of the third quarter. Fourth quarter is underway right now. We'll be right back. Here's a State Farm assist of the game. And which, which one do we have? Well, there's an always solution. It was three. With an amazing alley oop by McKee that was happening here in the first period. Along no other that took their mercy rule right away from the, uh, right away from each other. You might need to know what will happen well, if Danny Green takes so another far, assist. I the fourth quarter, a lot of matching going on here for for each uh, quarter spot. The way off the target. Davis, like this. I cannot remember what we have here. Anyways, let's get started off with the fourth quarter. And here we go. Over in the corner. Over in the corner is Cordwell Pope. To Back to James. He's up. Oh! James finds Davis without seeing Austin Kupo to look in, but the league lead was in a change. And it looks like Cardwell Pope with the steal. He's up in. And he doubles it in. First bucket of the night right now is Cardwell Pope. You're in the right place. Uh, but both of these teams locked in. Rolls it up over the to Middleton. Going to be a high scoring affair tonight. James Middleton to Ro Robin Lopez. Off the mark there. It's off the mark. Lakers leading by five. 550 left to go. And this is it to LeBron. LeBron James against Middleton. Bradley against Bledsoe. Bradley against Bledsoe. 
won't lose. He's up again. Lakers still has the ball. Ten seconds left. Here's a look at the shot clock. Your upcoming schedule will be the Bucks as they'll be at, at away in LA in game five. Then in game six, they'll be back home at Milwaukee. If that's the stretch of the schedule. That you dream of winnable games at home against Here's the McGee. You know Finish the drive. It would take a lot for this game. It would take a lot of time right now. There's nobody, man, no man's recovered right now. And that's very frustrating. On the wing, Giannis. Back to Lopez. Robert Lopez to Middleton. Middleton. Passing it back to Brooke Lopez. Six on the shot. Pass to Ashton Cupo. Here's He's up. And he is dunked up over Anthony Davis. He's down right on the um, right on the momentum, but I wasn't you. You haven't just noticed what Austin Cooper can do. He gets dunked on anybody that he that he knows all the players. And it is blocked, but Davis takes it back. Under five minutes left here, 60 to 53 to score. Bledsoe to take the three. Good, right in the corner. Assist by Antetokounmpo. Very good, uh, very good uh, shots from Bledsoe. I was playing up here with just 11 points last season, last game, in game three. That might be the most improved player that was ever going to be facing it up. Another block by Brooke Bolton. Block and now be on Brooke Lopez. A smart block, if you will. Bledsoe with another three. A wide open, and he's right all over the place. One from the wing, one from the middle, and as we get probably the corner. I don't know what. I don't know if he might be getting into the corner, but they're catching it up on fire. Four and nine left. James against Middleton. Marking the fourth quarter, almost on his way down. Davis, spinning a move. Lopez. Lopez trying to stop it. A lot of possession going up for the Lakers, but Anthony Davis needs to keep it clear. Here's Davis. Got to put it in. The deep made at number two. Timeout called by the Milwaukee. The Bucks. 3:45 left to be player of the game. Anthony Davis and their team could be could be a win in Game Four if they have another chance to go for it. played the point guard. A different look here for the Bucks and the Lakers. Here's Robin Lopez on the court, and he's checked in for uh, for Robin, for Brook Lopez. And here's uh, Green on the court, checking in with David Aldridge. He reads. We really got after him in the huddle. He said, look, you can rest after the game. You got to put it all out there if you want to win this one. Back to you guys. Well, short commentary for here, D.A. That James might be a lot of choice set for here for Mike Budenholz to do a help now. He was capable of more than he showed him. And it's blocked by the Greek freak. What a nice block that time to stop it in by James. Now he passes over to Bledsoe. Bledsoe passed down to Kupo. Rolling it on to Robin Lopez. Shot clock down to six. And the pass to Bledsoe. Shoots over LeBron, and it's off the backcourt back here as Bradley pick up another rebound. Bradley up top. Bradley on top, guarded by Bledsoe. Davis, Davis taking a three, knocks it out from the corner, and timeout, Milwaukee, the Bucks. Anthony Davis is pulling up at the street better than Rudy Gobert by the last game. But it could be a lot more challenging that was ever going to be playing. Not just the only one that was going to be uh, listing all over the games. This is like a killable run for tonight. Not a lot of, not everybody seems to be uh, getting back into its uh, position. But that's very tough to look for. Anyways, that's all I need to go for. Now here's your Jordan player of the game. This one is out by Anthony Davis. And when you expect about Anthony Davis, that is the only man that was the most improved player in game one. Now in game four, he's on he's Jordan player of the game. He has just killed them. 
down he's low. Like, he, he's like, he was never going to get here in time. If Antetokounmpo has that dunk, I'll show you what the price is. But that doesn't mean, like, he wants to take it all and win the money. By four. That's something else that you need to know about that. And here's what What so? Pass to Antetokounmpo. And he made it again! Assist by Blitzo, and it's not that bad that Antetokounmpo sending out the biggest game that he was ever gonna stop. That's a momentum changer right there. 227 left here to play in the fourth quarter. Bradley again. Pass to Davis. Here's Davis. Again, again, Davis smokes out the court. Davis has got 19 points over Bunzo of 18 with 10. The more that you level up in the game of basketball, it bounces fast on Stukupo. Identifying the weakest link. And the Bucks still has some time before the uh, final quarter comes to an end. Here's Bunzo. Here's Bunzo, and that messes up. That messes him up entirely. With a bodily. Finally, base, base mask game on them. Nice ball movement. Good ball movement here for the, uh, for the Lakers to be pouring out. 142 left. Just find the shoot. Try to pull it. Green with no time. And it is. Look a lot of luck. Almost put a steal on Bledsoe. But here comes the Greek break. Finish the drive. And he picks up a nine, eight points on the game. A lot of time over here, just going out way wild. James against Corper. James still surveying the floor. Now James inside. By Davis, don't get it. Assist by James. Once Davis gets the receive with the time that he was taking, that he might be getting on time. And that call be the offensive foul on Antetokounmpo. First personal foul, and the fans are hating it. They just don't really like the call. That's what the problem is. Not a good sight here for, for the Bucks to come out with a, or with a shocking lead. James softly touched it right for me, Leo. James, one of the best ever to do it. Milwaukee has gone for Milwaukee trying to go for an early. Matthews, three, outside from the wing, and assist by Bledsoe. Now the Bucks are catching it up here. This could be the tying point if they if they take the steal or another miss by the Lakers player that made it out or did, and they stealed it. Anjikupo wanted to tie it. Bledsoe with the tie. Yes! What a huge game this is! But the second to last timeout will be Lakers. What a saving game for the Bucks to score from outside position without making mistakes. <sighs> yeah, I know, right? <clears throat> but the last call I'm going to change is I'm bringing Elias Sofa in. Thank you, Eric Bledsoe, for making a tie, but one of each player might go for the uh, buzz beater. Heal. And then Wesley Matthews, I'm going to make him switch to, uh, to, uh, to Connaughton. And I'm going to last change here as Robin Lopez, so we'll, I'm subbing him out. And I'm bringing Brooke Lopez, I mean, Antetokounmpo. Oh, wait, he's, he's already out of gas here. Man. And I'm bringing Brooke Lopez right in the game. Now i got to watch him right down from the lane. And watch, push the pace more, limit the transaction, and play the series, C-point series. All right, here we go, man, lads. Everybody's getting get very tough. The Bucks fans are going wild. 35 seconds left to play. Let's find out who can make the game four with the win. Bradley coming in. Shot went off. Brook Lopez coming in. Middleton. Carleton missed it. Last time out called by the Lakers. As Frank Vogel decides to use their final timeout and make another change. Shocking moment here. It was not well enough to pick up every score along the way to make that score even tricky. But that's very tough and very dangerous to go from uh, to go from the outside. 
Now the last one is half court press. This might be the only uh, only tough look here. Actually, two free zones. Full court trap here. I don't know if it's gonna it's gonna work right. No, not a not a choice here, but that's gonna be full court press. Yeah, this one here. Coming down the wire, 18.4 seconds. Bradley trying to find the trying to floor to go for it, but Connaughton what decides to go for the steal. He got it! And Hill will finish. And he got it! What a nice game for Hill to stop by. Last possession for the Lakers. Here's James. James trying to go for the tie. The lead? No way. No way. Game four win. Bucks take the win. 73 to 71 with a nice score position. And the finish drive was George Gill. What a stun by the Lakers to keep its pace right from that lane. And that's was just a lot of bad contacting right from the outside. Now let's go to DA. Thanks, Kevin. Wesley, great night for you. How did it all come together? Team's doing a great job of getting me open, uh, and our guards are finding me, and I'm just putting the ball in the basket when I can. You were open and available all night, Wesley. Thanks very much. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you so much, your DA. Bucks take the lead series three, three to one. What a standable play from uh, from the, each players on the court. Right now, we like to say thank you guys so much for watching. As for Game Five, the Lakers are back home. And they'll be playing against the Bucks in L.A. And if game necessary, it will be game six as the Lakers head back to Milwaukee to play against the Bucks. No matter what will happen with the score, if it's going to be very tough to look. If the Bucks wins the chip, wins this finals, then they claim it all. But if the Lakers win, win the fifth game, then they're going to have to like rematch the game in game six. And if they don't do it well enough for the Bucks, and the Lakers keep winning again, then they're going to Game Seven. We may not show, we may not know what's going to happen here by the last game. Well, well, we'll have to find out what will happen next. So, anyways, thank you guys for so much for watching it. I hope you enjoyed the NBA Finals of this presentation. We hope you enjoyed that uh, a lot of a bunch of play, a lot, bunch of highlights, and we have really enjoyed it to you. Anyways. That's going to include with Game 4 of the Bucks against the Lakers. And so until next time, peace out, bitches, for as a while as the NBA Finals style. Good night in Milwaukee.